Are you happy with the temperature? Are you sure? Because I know that after I wash you down, you like to luxuriate and have a nice soak in the tub for some time. So I want to make sure that it's warm enough for you. It doesn't go cold afterwards. Is that okay? Good. Okay then. Yes, I'll make sure you have a very nice relaxing bath. And as I said, I'll wash you down. I've got some nice foamy, lathery, soapy suds so that I can give you a nice scrub and wash you down. And then after that, I've actually found a nice treatment to put through your hair, your scalp. So I can do that for you. And I think that'll leave you very refreshed and relaxed before you turn in for the night and go to bed. Does that sound good? Well, you are a grown adult, but uh, I'm your butler, so that's what I'm here for. And I know that you like me to draw the bath for you and make sure that you're nice and comfortable, so I'm, I'm happy to do that for you, yes. And I'm going to prepare the, the water with some crystals and some, some of the salts that I've found. The legal kind of bath salts, yes. But although I'm here to please you, I just have to... I'm going to have to take Mr. Quacky, okay? Because the junior mistress and the junior master of the house, they've been looking for Mr. Quacky for a very long time. And I have my suspicions that you'd taken him hostage, but now I can see he's here, so... Dear. Well, maybe I'll, maybe I'll give him back after I've given you your wash down, okay? And after we've gone through the bath rituals, okay? Don't worry, he'll be safe. He'll be safe. Yes. Okay, so I shall add some nice salts to your bath, which will relax you. I found them. Mm-hmm. Yes. I'm sure. Well, it's been a very busy week for you, but don't worry. Now this is your time to relax and unwind. And let me take care of you, so don't worry about any of that, okay? Nothing of that is of any consequence, it doesn't matter. Okay, so do allow yourself to enjoy the water, the hydrotherapy. It's very healing to be in the water. Okay, so firstly, we'll add some salts to the bath, which I know you'll find healing as well. A nice fresh packet of them and I'll read what it says. These salts contain pure minerals which have stood the test of time. Generations of people have relied on its natural values as it is absorbed through the skin surface to gently help support the removal of toxins. The Epsom bath salts will help relax the body and mind to promote a restful night's sleep whilst leaving the skin soft with a silky texture. Okay, so we'll add some of them and I think I might add them by hand and I can stir them in afterwards and I think you'll find them very relaxing. They have the scent and the aroma of eucalyptus, which is so beautiful. There we are. And they're a beautiful texture. Just slightly coarse. And I think they'll have a nice sort of an exfoliating effect on your skin as well. Add 
feeling the salt, the healing power of the salt. Just like in the ocean. When you step into the ocean and it heals your wounds. There we are. You can feel it, yes. Yes, it's very powerful. It's such a natural substance. Yes, it should be very refreshing on your toes as well, on your feet. Okay. Let's give that a bit of a stir. There, they're all dissolving in. I want to add ingredient by ingredient until we have the perfect recipe to get you feeling on top of the world. There we are, it's all dissolving into the water. Okay, time for the next ingredient. Bath crystals. And these have some wonderful salts in them, different kinds of salts, but also some dried rose petals. And actually I have quite a few, a few different selections of rose petals with me today, so I will add them to your bath as we go along. I know you like them, and I know that they give you that feeling of luxury, of royalty, and that executive feeling that just elevates your spirits. It's amazing how just a little touch like that, like the rose petals, can bring out that majestic nature that you have. Mmm, really heavenly smell, I'm sure you'll agree once they're in the bar and everything begins to evaporate. Let's see, I'm not sure what sort of quantity we want to put in today. But I just want to see going on now. Yeah, it's really beautiful little dried rose petals in there in amongst the salt grains, which is very pretty. I think we can go a bit more adventurous. Are you getting the fragrance there? Beautiful scent of the rose just coming up in ribbons of air to my nose. Mm, it's going nicely with the steam from the bath, isn't it? Is it giving you the feeling of luxury? Good. So you want you to be pampered and spoiled and well tended to. Mm hmm. More petals coming down now. making sure the salt and the rose petals are evenly spread throughout your tub, traveling all up to the other end and back again. Let's get that water circulating all around you, feeling the hot water envelop you, 
enjoying the sensations. Gently undulates and folds around the curves of your body. Refreshing and relaxing you. Mm. There we are. Refreshing and relaxing you. Preparing you for a night of calm sleep. Yes, of course. Very well. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, so before you got in the tub, I know that you took a nice refreshing shower to make sure that you were cleansed of all the debris of the dust of the day. But now I shall take some time to give you a nice sponge down just to relax you, exfoliate your skin, and make sure that you're thoroughly, thoroughly cleansed, okay? Because I know that you enjoy that, okay? So I'm just going to put on my scrubbing mitts. And these will help exfoliate your skin as well. Got a nice, enjoyably coarse texture. A magician, don't I? I have to do some magic and make sure that we get you feeling really, really ace. Okay. Okay, so I have two sponges. I'll just prepare them in the rose water. It's okay, I know it's not you. It's this sponge. I'm just allowing it to absorb all the healing properties before I give it a good squeeze. Okay. Just leaving a little of the juice in there. This is a delicious aloe vera mousse, which will help to cleanse you in a very delicate, aromatic way. It's a little trick I discovered when you apply it to the sponge and just let it absorb through the top layers of the sponge. There. As soon as I start massaging it into your skin, it just all comes to the surface in the most executive way. Just coaxing out some of those suds. The sponge is prepared as it truly should be.
start on your shoulders, okay? That's it, just over each clavicle. Mm -hmm. There we are, relax now. Under the neck and over the top of the chest. Sit the sides of the arms. Okay. And the shoulders. Over the top of the shoulders. That's it. Along the top of the back. Keep the water nice and hot. That's it. Is that nice on the shoulders? Yeah. Okay. Down the back. Down the back. You just twist around. I know it's a large bath, so that'll just help me do your back a bit more thoroughly. There we are. Just going along your shoulder blades there. There we are. Really just easing out that tension. Coming down the mid back. And the lower back. There we are. Okay. Up and down the sides. Okay. Perfect. Yes, of course. It's a nice feeling, just feeling my hand plunge in the hot water. Okay. 
The bath water's looking very sudsy now. It's quite glorious. So I think before I wash, wash down your bottom half, I think I'll add a couple of other ingredients to the, the potion that we have here. I've got a bath bomb, which will hopefully fizz and it might change the color of the water a little bit. We'll see in the suds. And I've also got um, a crumbly bath block which also has some rose petals and some more rose petals to scatter into the water. So let's take a look and see what they're like. Yes, here's the bath bomb. Nice yellow one. What does it say? Angel face. It's like a little candy love heart. It says angel face, just like you. So yeah, I'm not sure whether to break it up or to put it all in at once. Let's just go for it, shall we? Try it all at once. Let's see if it makes any kind of fizzing noise. Now, I know you relieved yourself before getting into the tub, so this colour certainly doesn't mean that you've had an accident, but I think we might have to um, add the bath crumbles because I'm not sure that yellow bath water is quite the effect that I wanted. So we shall add some crumbles. See what that does before we get on with washing in. Okay, so I have a bowl of this bath crumble here on a bed of roses, and I'll put the rose petals in a little bit later. But first, let's try this crumble, see what happens. It's like a molten spa. And the water is becoming a nicer pinky colour now, which is a bit more attractive than the yellow. Start making the bathtub rather like a jacuzzi. Jacuzzi, jacuzzi, jacuzzi. So fizzy, fizzy, fizzy. It's all fizzing like sherbet on the tongue. Blend that in with the rest of the water. Okay. Okay, and now we'll wash it down the rest of your body. Okay, just go over the tops and the sides of the legs. Both legs. Set. All the way down into the feet. There we are. I'll just take this leg. enjoying those sensations all sides of the legs from the thighs all the way down 
to the toes, thighs down to the toes, there we are. Okay. Very good. Okay, and this leg, from the thighs, the thighs there at the top, the loins, there we are, down the edge and over the top. There we are, enjoying that. Rub-a-dub-dub. -dub. Three men in a tub. Okay, and down to the toes. Okay, there we are. Down, down, down. Enjoying. Relaxing. There we are, over the top of the legs. Each side over the top and all the way down. There we are. Okay. It's lovely. Water the colour of Turkish delight now. And it smells like Turkish delight as well because it's got all the rose running through it. Mm -hmm. And you're enjoying that feeling of luxury, as I tend to you, and serve you. There we are. Okay. Okay, there we are. And now that you're all washed down and thoroughly cleansed, I'm going to add some bath foam. Yes, more foamy mixture into the tub. And this one has the most delicious fragrance. It's frosted sprinkles, uh, bath foam bain mousson, and it's very sugary, sweet frosted fragrance. So I'll pour some more of that in for you just to keep the, um, the water feeling luxurious. I'm going to add a little bit of extra hot water as well to make sure you're a really nice temperature which is just right. And then I'll scatter some rose petals and do your hair for you, okay? And then you can take your time to relax. But let's add some of this bath foam to the hot water here. Speak glollop. Is glollop a word? And as we stir this in, the tub will get more foamy and even more sweetly scented. Smells divine. Mm, smells delicious.
Okay, so for that extra touch of luxury, I have the dry rose petals for you. I'm just going to sprinkle them over the foam. Just to decorate you and to decorate the water. Encourage that feeling of refinement, delicate nobility, luxury, pure luxury, the scent of rose. To adorn you, your body, relax you. The dust from the roses. There we are. It's beautiful, isn't it? Nice sensual bath. There we are. Okay. And I think now that you're starting to relax, we can restore Mr. Quacker's rightful place, bobbing that. It's a bit nice of him there now. And I can start applying. Some product to your hair, which will help condition it while you sit there and soak. Okay. I know you like to have a nice long soak in the tub. What you can do, I'll, I'll lower the lights before I leave leave you in a very relaxed state, okay? So I'm just going to spray some of this argan oil and aloe vera into your hair, okay? Just lean forward for a moment. Okay, that's it. Through. Actually, I've got a better comb. Yes, this one will do nicely. There we are. It's just, and it makes it slip through really, really easily through the comb. Product. Regardless of the length of your hair, whether it's long or short, just taking the comb over the tops of your shoulders as well. There we are. Okay, just to give you that extra relaxation and the sensation of the touch. There we are. So you can enjoy the candlelight now as you relax. There we are. Mr. Quackers, go on, you can have a swim, Mr. Quackers. There we are. But after this bath, I must send Quackers back to the children of the house because you are a grown adult and it's not fair to hold, hold him hostage here all this time. There we are. Okay, there we are. Nice and calm and relaxed. There we are, exquisite luxury. There we are now. Exquisite luxury. There we are. 
not a care in the world, just floating up there in the clouds. There we are, it's nice and soothed, there we are. Are you feeling well? I hope I've given you a wonderful bathtub experience. I hope that you're drifting in the clouds and feeling well looked after, cared for. There we are. It's a privilege to care for you, look after you and make you feel better. There we are. Nice and clean. Perfectly beautifully relaxed. The water's still nice and hot. There we are, relax now. That should be nice and just right around your feet there. That's it. There we are. Soon you'll be slipping into a nice fluffy robe and I'll give you a nice pat down and make sure that you're all dry. And I'll help you turn in for the night. Put you to bed. You can have a long, deep, beautiful sleep. dream of magical, gorgeous things, these watery sounds might conjure up images of lakes, streams, brooks, Dreams. River dreams. River dreams.